do a two minute Tuesday last week. Had nothing interesting to say. But maybe I do today. We'll see. So it's Tuesday. Let's go. Hey guys, what's up, man? It is Tuesday, and I hope you're having a great week. Um, listen, I just wanted to. Oh, I got a lot of things running through my head. A couple of things you're gonna see updated and, and posted on the blog this week, probably this weekend. Um, but I wanted to talk today about just like keeping a, a clear head. It's easy when things go south and, and kind of shit goes sideways in life to to lose track of uh, of what's going on. And uh, lately, that's kind of been where I'm at. You know, it's between just like, you know, finances and, and cars and dumb stuff in life, you just, you, you kind of get bombarded, especially when it all comes at one time. And, uh, and that's how it's been for us lately. And, and the hard thing is, is like keeping a clear and positive head when, uh, when all that shit goes south and that's tough, but I just want to encourage you guys that when, when you're having a rough day, when you're having a rough week, things are, are poor behind the chair or no matter what your job is, you know, you just, if you just keep, keep focused on what's ahead of you and where you're at and not what's going on behind you because going on behind you gets you nowhere. You have to focus on on the here and now because that's what's going to get you you know ahead of the game. So on that note I hope everybody just has a really great week. Uh, keep your head up, stay positive, uh, books to check out, um, read Ed Milet's book uh, hashtag max out. And I'm really excited because uh, my next book I want to read is uh, Positive Mental Attitude by John Joseph. Uh, and if you don't know who that is, uh, he, uh, he was a front man for uh, one of New York's greatest bands, the cro -Mags. So uh, check that book out as well. So on that note, peace. <laughs>